Gotta love that sweet, sweet quick, re quick resume. What's up, everybody? Good evening. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Hope you all are enjoying your day. Morning, afternoon, evening. What have you? Yes, I am uh, busting out the two liter of regular Mountain Dew now because we had we had a pizza party, a pizza party in celebration of Passover ending. Since we live in a, uh, I guess it's a mixed religious household because I'm not Jewish, but the wife is. Uh, I'm really kind of a non-practicing, not I'm really, like, I am, in fact, a non-practicing Catholic. Um, but we still do celebrate Christmas, and, um, we don't necessarily celebrate Easter. Um, in the sense of, like, going to church and stuff like that, but we do do an Easter hunt. Because once, because like Christmas, Easter has become one of those holidays that uh, started off being strictly, uh, strictly a Catholic holiday, and is now kind of is kind of practiced by both Catholics and non-Catholics. Odd. It's odd kind of now that I'm thinking Snow about it more. Alright. Well, now the question is how many of them are there? Oh dear. We gotta go. Oh. Roach! Come here! Roach! We gotta go! Roach! Fine. Fine, Roach, you're on your own. See you later. What am I saying? Oh, um, uh, well, I'm saying that I'm running away from this giant dra this dragon right now. Because I am not strong enough to take it out. So, crap, 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 running, running, running. Well, I was just saying that, um, um, hi, Mom, by the way. Um, okay. Think. Okay. Okay. Alright. Oh, that was... Oh, there's two monsters nests right next to each other. Well, that's a thing that happened. Cool. Um, I was just saying that instead of my regular Diet Mountain Dew, I was drinking a two liter Mountain Dew in celebration because we had a pizza party um, to celebrate Passover ending. Oh, there you are. Glad you made it away from that dragon to which I basically abandoned you. Um, but you're alright. Um, Come on, Roach. Um, because there was, uh, you know, so we had a pizza party to celebrate Passover ending. Um, and I was just talking about how we're a kind of a mixed religious household because, you know, I'm Catholic, even though I'm really, like, Slow now. Um, Slow now. oh, faster. Oh, oh, is, well, how, how bad is this? Oh, level 23. Okay, well. We'll just do what we did before then. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Um, and I was just commenting about how we're a... Oh, hey. Um, how we're a mixed religious household. Um, and it just... Hey, I am... Almost... Whoa, hey. Ow. Be rude. Ow, come on. There we go. Jeez, Jeez. Alright. Woo. Hey, 
you out here real quick and Jeez Louise, there we go. Oh what oh what am I playing? Um I am playing Witcher 3. Uh The Wild Hunt. This is my Monday my Monday and Wednesday project, and then uh on Friday I do uh I call it Variety Friday where I pick a random game and play it. There and then run away. Kablooey. Yaw. Uh. <laughs> no worries. It's it's okay. Um, thanks for coming by. You can always at least you can always still um, check out the video replay later. Um, it's okay though. I appreciate you trying. Appreciate you coming to hang out. It's all good. That's my mom. I love my mom. She supports my sis both my sister and I in our streaming projects. So, makes me happy. And, and normally this is kind of late for her, plus because her internet's not the greatest, that she, um, she has problems being able to play it, playing it live, I should say. Oh, another monster's nest. Oh, no. Alright. Oh, dear. Alright. I'm eating another chicken leg. Wee! Wee! No, no, and I didn't save after I got rid of the first one. Son of a gun. Oh, that's annoying. I get, I get lazy with it. That's that's frustrating. Err. Um. Worried there for a second there because she said what I was. What was I saying? And I thought she was talking about <laughs> um what I was talking about with the um. The religious conversation, which you know, I'm not afraid to talk about it, but it's just when she just let me just sit, let's just say that when she said, "What are you playing?" I went, "Oh, okay, never mind. We're good." So, but going back to the point I was making, um, it's interesting how, especially like the two big ones. In terms of, I don't need to go up there because I know what's up there. Slow now. Certain doom. Um, it's just interesting how those, especially Christmas and Easter specifically, but those two major Catholic holidays have this very... I'm just gonna write it across the field here. Um, have these very non religious Not aspects so to them. Um, so obviously with Christmas you you know Alright, alright. Sound like Donald Duck here. Whee! Oh my god, they do kind of sound like Donald Duck. Ow! Hey! Whee! Alright. All right, now the only other thing that's left is... You're hiding. Oh, hey, not cool. There we go, cleaned up. Um, and it's just, um, you know, because Christmas you obviously have, you know, all the things about Jesus' birth and all that, and at the same time you have Santa Claus. Uh, you know, Easter on one hand, you have, you 
know, Jesus rising, you know, rising from the dead. Um, and then on the other hand, you have the Easter Bunny. Necker's surface here. Yeah, I'm really. Their way out. Uh, I'm really trying to think if there's any other kind of holiday where there's like a clear religious aspect to it. Or it's clearly a religious holiday, and then they just, um, they create this, like, non-religious, there's this non-religious aspect to it that's created to uh, appeal to more people, appease the non-religious people, I don't really know. house ooh silver ingot that's always good a weird thing to randomly find wow a silver ingot and amethyst dust really weird things to find in some random field but you know what are you gonna do um That's the, um... Oh, no, it says that's, like, a new quest, basically. Alright. Well, let's go clear out these question marks, and then we shall go investigate that question mark. Oh, I'm riding the wrong way. I'm riding... I did that thing I do again, where it's, like, I... It's telling me to follow the white air... The white dots. I'm following the white dots. The white dots are going towards not the way you want to go. All right, Neckers, let's go. Ah, no! That was annoying. That was super annoying. That's the opposite of what I wanted to happen. I didn't want, I don't want to keep getting on the horse. I wanted to get off Roach, Roach let Roach run away, and then I get dealt with all of them. Off to move it. Uh, so bossy. Um, <coughs> I'm just trying to think if there's any other religious holidays of any religion, honestly, where you have like a religious aspect to it, like the actual religion part, and then you have the non religious. <laughs> My brain, uh, I also think that my brain that, um, God, they're so fast. They're so fast. Mm. Kind of wish I could just go in and tank swing them. What I mean by tank swing them means I go in as a tank and I just swing. I think the armor I'm wearing is technically like We'll just chill. We'll chill for a sec, get that last little bit of healing before we move on. Um. Ooh. Interesting. Or I, may, I may have to heal. I may have to repair that. See kind of what I can get for it. All right. So let's heal. Let's heal up for a sec. It's been, take a minute to heal. 
So, like I said, um, I can't think of any other religion. Of course, I don't know that much. I know about Judaism. I know about Catholicism. I don't really... I don't... My knowledge is very limited in, with anything else. But I really can't think of any other religious holidays for any religion where the... Um, it's a religious-based holiday, but there's such a large non-religious... Um, events that happen around it. As for not being able to put it any other way. But anyway, that's where the 2 liter of regular Mountain Dew came from as opposed to my regular 20 ounce or 24 ounce Diet Mountain Dew. I normally drink at night. Because that's insanely healthy. I'm... I really gotta. I was good there for a while with my snacking habits at night, especially when I was on. Especially when I'm streaming, because obviously when you see me streaming, I'm really. Yeah, I'm drinking soda, which isn't awesome, but I don't really drink soda during the day. I usually drink water or. Uh, regular water, or we have flavored water. I drink uh, a cup of coffee in the morning, that's about it. Um, part of the problem is. My wife, God love her. She is very supportive and understanding about a lot of things. Um, she knows I like Diamond Mountain Dew, so pretty much anytime it's on sale, she buys me some. And usually buys me a decent amount because... I don't want to say I have an addictive personality, but what I will say is... Yeah, get out of here, Roach. You're fine. I got these little buggers. What? There we go. Haha. And the problem is these guys have their like rolling jumps timed perfectly where I'm Oh dear, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Get out of there. Alright. God, see, they time it so perfectly where it's like... They're in sync with each other. So, if, like, one's jumping, the other one's, like, get it, finishing its jump. Like, I just have to keep rolling. Uh... first guys were easy why are these guys being more difficult i mean it's literally the same guys it's the same number of guys so it's not like i i went from battling like six to twelve i'm battling the same six maybe Come seven on, it's the same number i was battling before that's it roach not so fast roach all right They have it like everything timed up perfectly. Did not want to do that. There we go. Alright, come here. There we go. Alright. I just had to, I don't want to say cheat, but I just had to use my resources all right now let's get rid of this other monster pit Necker's surface here dig their way out not anymore running 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 all right clear That was when I just... Where is it? Aw. 
random dead dude. That's annoying. I mean, that's very tragic that he lost his life. And I hope he did not have any family or his... Another Necker pit. Right. Right, I only have one Thunderbolt left, so I gotta make it count. I don't know. I ain't, I ain't waiting. I ain't. Ow! God, uh. There we go. Time out, bad guys. Time out. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta repair my, my, uh. There we go. Okay. Time in! I'm not going to get beat by freaking one. Come here. Come here. That was close. That would have been... That would have been aggravating. This monster pit, Mechanism and then dig their way out. <sighs> what what kind of what what bomb do I need again? Oh, wait a minute. Destroy monsters' nests. Free 60, free 60 XP. All right, now that that's done and over with, a hey. what's that? Hidden treasure. Non cleared out. Okay. What's up with that? Yeah, I can run. Yeah, that away now. Oops. Oh, well. Not too bad. Alright, what do we got here? What do we have here? What's, what's all this? I'm just gonna take this. Okay, now I'll talk Looking to you. for ghouls? Why? 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 Just to do me in. Been in a bad way for days. Final Ugh. breaths like. Dude, you were. So and I love that he's just like, wow, with all that boil on your face. We met before. I pulled me from under a pile of stiffs. I was sure their scourge had never touched me. So yeah. sure. You so do funny. not. That is. Oh, Listen, on that back of the head, too. Did, did me a kindness once. Do me another. Got a sharp sword there. Finish this. Sorry. Can't do that. I beg you. No. No, why the hell not? You disgusted. A fear of your conscience. Oh, God, no, I would kind of want to try to save you. 
I'll pay ye. If you won't, get out of my sight. Let me die in peace. If you won't, hold on. Okay, well, that's kind of... no. That's kind of weird. Siri collapsed in the swamp. Some peasants found her and took her to the Baron, Bellum's self-appointed roof. The warlord took the young woman in, had her nurse back to health, then sent her on her way Come to on. the Come on! Okay, thank you for the recap. There you go. Okay, well, I guess I guess I'll kill you then. Looking for ghouls? No one else. Did. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Hi. Listen. All right. I'm sure. I beg you. Do it quick. Then burn my Please, remains. Sorry. All right. Sangi. Take this. Thought I'd leave some coin for me young'uns. But they've no need of it now. Why? Ugh. There. He said burn it, so I'm gonna burn it. some money out of it so I guess now watch there's gonna be some terrible thing where it's like oh my dad's okay and I'm gonna be like uh, me too bye not gonna lie that'll suck Back to you, Roach. I got my one experience. Hey, horsey. Who's a good pup? Who's a good horsey? Yes, you are. Who's a good horsey? I'm not gonna save for a while, just in case. Once again, know what those are, so I'm not gonna mess with them. Move it! Uh, like I said, it's not gonna surprise me based on like how much this game messes with you that I'm gonna run to like some town and I'm gonna be like, "Oh, me pa, we've got the medicine for him. I hope he's, I hope we can find it in time." Slow now. Whoa. And we like, uh, faster. Bye. Go, go. Toder Toderas. Whoa there, Roach. Over, we'll save over that one. Steal much. All right, what do we got? See any monsters? Hey, eh? sword off. We've no need for you. Sword off, witcha. Actually, I see a few monsters. Where? Oh, ready, damn it! Dumber than a hunk of lard you are. He means us. We are common folk. You're the mutant. Poxy freak, get him, lads. Oh. Bastards. What? Lost your nerve? Oh. 
Ah, try it again. Come on, come on guys. I know you got your cute little shields. Hold on, gotta eat some fish. Come on, fellas. It's alright, it's alright. I ain't gonna bite. Ow. Oh, apparently you will. Ow! That is rude, good sir. There we go. like thinks like oh, okay just go in and clear him out like that's fine and good but on the other hand part of me is like should I have done that like could there have been Dwarven spirit coming out of the eyeball. I feel like I should be doing something with it. <coughs> and it's These guys, okay, so yeah, all those guys are dead, but clearly there's other people that are dead here, so. Like, on the one hand, yeah, like, that guy's clearly dead. And then I thought I saw, yep, there's dead people clearly back here, too, so. Aw, oh, hen house. Rip. A nice little, nice little hovel of an area. looking chest for a broken ring. I love art. I love like games like this. Nice little village, like, huh? Oh, well, oh, I and so once again, like, okay, so clearly I did the save over for the, um. Um, for that guy, because now it's a guy, in retrospect, I'd kind of rather kill him. Oh, 
course. Sorry, Roach. I banded you again. Just don't eat the ho don't eat the grass next to the next to that horse. That'd be bad. Very bad. Don't do that. Um. Like this is a game that if I was playing it off stream, I would probably reload it. Take it easy. There. Come. On. Really. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. All right. Fine. All right. Let's. There. All right. Okay. And go. And. Foglet. I save already? I feel like I, don't know, I can't anyway. I'll check it out though. I think. Alright, let's consult the bestiary. Bossy, bestiary. Foglets. Alright, so. Microphage Royal. Hewn. I have necrophage oil already. I do. actually taking this guy out. oil on maybe the shield should have been maybe the shield should have been better but I did not focus on that I focused on other stuff alright alright and it's funny too because I had the enhancement on my armor I had the insane Enhancement on my sword. And he still basically wiped the floor with me. Alright, well. Go, go. Well now I'm annoyed, so I'm gonna give it an I'm gonna give it another go. Oh, what, it's not here now? Oh, well, no wonder it was partially difficult. There was two of them. Okay. Oh. I think I quasi eat my way out of a win there. Into a win. So... Hi. I really think I got that treasure chest when I wasn't supposed to. It's fine though. I don't mind. Once in a while, you'll cheat. You'll. <sighs> Once in a while, you'll take the cheap victories when they come. All right. Oh, 
Oh no, I see you, buddy. You ain't getting away. You ain't getting away. I see you there. I said that's that's really funny that I got to that chest. I totally think I got that chest when I wasn't supposed to. But hey, it's all good. Um, Fellas? Probably won't, but that's okay. You're almost dead. I breathe on you, you're dead. There we go. There we go. Ooh, a letter. Listen up, you stupid git. Uh, all right. Pretty sure I was just up here, so cool. again you'll take it you'll take it but that was incredibly easy wish you could sort those treasure hunt I feel kind of confident about being able to do swamp thing Secondary quests, I don't think that's going to do me any good. Because that is... Okay, so there's a damage shrine down there. Hmm, I don't know if that's legit or not. Huh, alright, well... Swamp thing, I've, uh, swamp thing I actually feel kind of confident about being able to do. Because I am level 12. I am. I am level 12 now. All I gotta do is just make sure I go to a, I go to a place that lets me There's a merchant in Benick. So let me go to Benick first. Let me go to Benick, sell stuff, stock up. And 
then I'll go and try to take out Swamp Thing. I forgot that it was like all the way bum bum fuck down there. Bum F, I should say. <sighs> so what's going on in the world? Um, it's been weird at work and when I say weird I mean like the primary job secondary job secondary job's fine you know it's there's not a lot of the drama or crazy well I don't want to say there's a lot of crazy I don't want to say there isn't any craziness that happens there's not a lot I wouldn't say it's just I'd say it's more weird stuff that happens at job in. Oh, this is a bad idea. Oh, this is a bad idea. Nope, I'm just gonna ride. Nope, see you later. Not in the mood. Okay. Admit it. Go, go. Hey, everyone. Don't mind me. I'm just Man, riding wildly into your town because I'm afraid of. Alright, 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Hey, yeah. Two o'clock in the afternoon. Where's the merchant? Come on, Roach. Really, no merchant. I could have sworn there was a merchant here. Whoa, there, Roach. All right. Well, that's annoying. Oh well. Um, it is odd things that happen. Odd thing that happened with the food delivery job. Nothing crazy. Um, okay, like, did it really take me here? Yeah, it did. Uh... Wraiths being here. But here we are. literally fallen for my trap card. Alright, come here. Oh, can I... Oh, I got you. I glitched ya. I got you on the glitch. You were stuck in a tree. <laughs> okay. I remember this being like a normal town. Why are there rates just hanging out? Yeah, because there's the board. What the hell happened here? Cause, yeah, because there's... Heck. I guess. I don't know about when in Rome. That may not be the right term, but while I'm here, man, I got dwarven spirit coming out of my eyeball. I feel like I either need to start using it or I need to just dump it. Okay, well, that guy 
Okay. That's... Kinda curious as to what happened here. Cause like I said the we uh, Huh. Like I don't even know if this this was in fact like this before and I just am misremembering it. Or something terrible happened here. Like Hopefully not as a result like like, part of me wants to say, like, I hope nothing happened here as a result of some action I did. But, if it, if this was something that, like, the game, like, I did something in-game and it influenced, like, the fact that this town is now wiped out. It would not surprise me. I mean, it wouldn't, because this game, like many games like this, is so much like, sure, you make a choice. That's the choice you're going to make. Good luck with that choice. Good luck with it. Hopefully it doesn't turn out terribly for you. Like, did something happen in that town? What? Got That's right, interesting. I forgot. Interesting. Alright, how about... I'm gonna sell you a ton of shit. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for... have much else I want to buy and I think that's the same problem that the problem I always have with this guy why not for buying all the shit I didn't need. Having fun playing in that barrel, my dude? Greetings. What's up? Wouldn't mind a what you got? Stock. Hopefully you have... I'm going to sell you some silver pantaloons. Hmm. Yep, can't sell that. Can't sell that. Can't sell that, apparently. Can't sell that. I mean, I probably could sell that, but I don't think I really should. Sell that. Sell that. Yeah. Oh dear. My bad. Okay, so I will, sure, I will buy that. Let's see here, I'll buy all of your waters. 
by all your nuts. Ooh, apple juice. Definitely buy the apple juice. That raw meat. Yeah, I don't need that. Alright, is there anything else I can sell? The other stuff that I was in the midst of already selling. Nope. Fish tech. I'm gonna save the pure silver. And right, I don't think. Nope. That works. Oh, well. Thanks, dude. Appreciate ya! Alright. Alright. Let's. Let's look at some alchemy. Okay. Not sure what that does. I will make that because that would be really handy. I did not realize that that's what that did, and I wish I would have gotten that a long time ago. Geralt's max vitality is increased with each foe killed. This increase lasts until he meditates or fast travels? Ooh. Ooh. That's really handy. Which one is that? The Night Wraith. I might have to... I might have to... I, I will remember that. Which one? Now I have to remember. Well, all of these take dwarven spirits, so I gotta reset. <gasps> Man, at some point I really gotta get a better office chair. Well, I mentioned it before. It's in two weeks. Um, my dad and I have a big, la uh, not a last minute, but a big, um, house restoration project to finish up, uh, down in the basement. So hopefully what I'll be able to do is finally move this whole setup down there. Um, and I might start, I might consider investing in other stuff. Like we have the computer desk set up on basically like a tall end table. <laughs> Um, might invest in another actual computer desk, um, a, a good office chair, because this one is, I'm pretty sure, going on, like, 20 years old, so it needs to be retired just because it's uncomfortable. I'm sitting on a pillow 
and even that pillow is old, so that's in, in beat up, so that's not even comfortable. Um, can you actually get a setup for the camera as opposed to a kid's table stacked on top of a laundry basket? Cutting edge here. And we do the best we can. Um, Aha! Um, Alright, well, I need to re. I'm gonna meditate. Just plop myself down here, give myself a nice 12 hour. Um, there we go. I feel pretty good about this. Um, so I guess let's go. And now it's like I read I read the description and it's like uh I feel really bad about that now. It's like, like obviously on the one hand, I feel bad for killing her and all that. Ow, ow, ow. Ugh. So, Foglet is a, that's the Necrophage, so I need to use the Necrophage oil, which once again, I'm pretty sure I still have some left. I gotta make sure the, uh, Well, let's see here. So let's let's beef this bad boy up. Right, so I can still cause burning. Five percent chance to stun. Another 2%. Alright, so that's 7% chance to stun. And then a 2% attack power, so... Oh! Oh my gosh! That, that sweet armor I have... Has not had any enhancements on it, when I... Could have very easily been putting... putting enhancements. Alright, so... Cune sign intensity, cune sign intensity, art sign... Why not? Right. 
So once again, take a minute, let the toxicity wear down. Alright. And to let the health regenerate. Um, so, let's talk about jobs. So the, uh, the full-time job, it's kind of weird. Um, and I really shouldn't be speaking this into the universe. I'm going to knock on wood to hopefully it can not be that bad. It's been pretty slow. Now, the talk has always been that it's the slow time of the year. The beginning of the year is always the slow time of the year. And, you know, a lot of people are thinking that, you know, a lot of people are saying, you know, with, the, with COVID happening, that um, companies aren't ordering as much sanitary and, like, paper products like toilet paper, paper towels, face tissues, stuff like that. They're not ordering as much as they would under normal circumstances. Um, and they're seeing an increase in product requests and orders for hand sanitizers, soap, stuff like that. Um, I gotta tell you though, like, it also doesn't help too that they reset how, um, they rearranged how accounts are managed and organized to more align with our sales unit so that way like you're reaching out to the same salesperson for you know regardless kind of what account you have uh, which you know and once again it makes sense but kind of as a result of that like a, uh, a decent number of accounts are taken off of my desk so I'm really down to like three major accounts. One of them is the super major one, obviously. The other two are... One of them keeps me busy constantly. Um, with... Because they bring in... Well, okay, so I gotta take that back. So there's four biggish customers I have left. The one super big one. Two that are decent size and keep me busy because they pretty much put in orders every day, even if it's only just like one or two. And the third one, which is my kind of problem child, because anytime they put in an order, I have to rearrange, like reprocess the order to get what they're saying, or I have to send them an email and say, hey, you ordered this. For this quantity at this price, did you mean to do that? Or did you mean to order this quantity at this price? And it's kind of a mess. Um, but the thing is, they don't order. That customer doesn't order with a lot of consistency or regularity. Um, well, they do regular, but not consistent. So, it's... Um, so, and it's nice because it gives you an opportunity to deep dive in the projects. And then if it's really like, okay, I have like... Pretty sure I have like 30 minutes where I don't have anything I need to do. I can swap out laundry. I can do dishes and run the dishwasher. I can start prepping, you know, get start figuring out dinner to prep dinner and stuff like that. But um, kind of going along the lines of like, you know, thinking about mental health and stuff like that. Like, kind of as a result of that, I'll have stretches where like kind of trying to find or I'm trying to find or I'm doing busy work. Granted, with having this kind of job, when I was, even when I was in the office full time, I was never one to like sit and try to chit chat with people for a long time. It's not that I, uh, I mean, I like talking to people. I like chit chatting with people, you know? consider myself easy to approach and good to have a conversation with you know. whether I am or not somebody else would, you know somebody else would have to discuss that uh, but I was focused on what I was doing and it also didn't help the fact that like I didn't really 
I've worked a lot of jobs in my day. And as a result, you tend to start, you know, and everybody's that's worked any kind of, you know, part-time or full-time job where they're around the same people all the time. You, you tend to, you know, get to know people, get friendly with them, become friends. You know, you and some of them you develop those deep personal relationships with that last forever. Some are like, oh, that's just Joe. I work with Joe. And then there's people that, like, you, feel, you get this really strong, deep connection with. And you consider them a really good friend. And then something happens and either you move on or they move on and you try to keep touch for a little bit as much as you can and then you realize that like you know you really don't have any um you don't really feel how do I say this it becomes harder and harder to motivate yourself? That's not even the right way. Find time or motivation to get to know that person. Not get to know that person. That's wrong. Stay in touch with them. Still consider them a strong still consider them a strong friend where you want to do stuff with them and you know, talk to them on the regular outside of like, you know, liking a post on Facebook or retweeting something or you know posting a comment on Instagram or whatever, what have you. Um, so because of that, like, the last couple jobs I've had... No, I take that back. Really, it's been this last one. Um, this last one and then the one before... And then two jobs before that. I really didn't feel like taking the time to get to know my coworkers. Like... On, like, that deep personal level enough that I would want to, like, hey, let's all go out for a drink after work. Or, oh, hey, it's my kid's birthday. Do you want to come? Because I've been, because too often I find that, like, people get really in touch, like, really involved in their, what they consider to be a friendship. But they end up just being a really strong, a really strong acquaintance that once something happens and you move on, it becomes harder. There's harder motivation to stay in touch with them. And it, and it, and I obviously don't want to speak for anybody. I can't speak for anybody but myself. Um, God, this is like kidding me. Want to like get on my phone and just start texting random people. Just be like, hey, I know it's been like two years since we've talked, but hi! <laughs> What's going on? Uh, I guess it's like... And I still struggle with it. And I think everybody will struggle with it. Um, this last year and change has really helped me realize that you can't always just rely on being around people to stay in contact or stay friends with them. You really need to take advantage of everything that's out there in order to stay connected. Um, you know, with the people at work, like the, the current first full-time job, it'd be very easy for me to just, you know, plug along, do my own thing, only reach out to people when I need help or assistance with something, um, maybe chit-chat a little bit during when we have our team meetings, you know, once every couple weeks. And that's really it. But like today, I had an IM conversation with, well, she was my manager and then we like I said we reshuffled the teams um and we just we chit-chatted about 
I mean, we just IM'd about her, um, the construction loan that she's trying to get for her and her husband to go build a house, which I thought they had, but no, they're, they're starting the process next week. Um, and then, yeah, there's, there's, a um, there's a person on my team that I feel like once every week, or once every two weeks, um, we have, we have a phone call where either I'm asking her about something or she's asking me about something. And then we end up just shooting the shit for an extra 30 minutes. Um, so there's, you know, people at work, um, all my non-work friends, um, I've got two different group text message chains going on. Um, I think that's I think it's important. And now I'm feeling really guilty. <laughs> I'm feeling really guilty about saying or thinking all these things. Um, yeah. So who's got two thumbs and is going to be going on a massive text message slash Facebook message reach out spree this guy tomorrow I start that tomorrow not today because it'll be good because you know uh, obviously the wife the wife's been home sporadically with the kiddo because of because um, she had spring break last week so she's been home sporadically so She'll be back at work. Abby will be back at school full time again, and so I'll have the whole house to myself. So I won't feel. So I uh, so I have stretches where I won't have to. I won't have anybody immediately in my vicinity to talk to. So to everybody out there that is friends with me, that hasn't heard from me in a while, guess what? I'm gonna be bugging the shit out of you. <laughs> um, I right. I need something to drink. Uh, BRB. Enjoy the calming, relaxing Slavic music and the beautiful background of my mantle. BRB. So I, mean, I there's at least three people that I'd immediately think of off the top of my head that well four now four that there's immediately pop popped into my head that I'm gonna be like all right that's gonna be like one of that's gonna be the first round of people that I'm gonna hit up all right enough about all that let's go kill us swamp thing. <laughs> I still love the fact that, like, one of the cool things about this game is that, hey, there's a boat. Hey, isn't there a question mark around here? Hold on, I got... Nope. There is! I'm gonna go check that out real quick. Since it's, like, right there. <coughs> oh! Monster nest. Okay. Alright. Well, there. Oh, it's a drowner monster. Okay. Ow, 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 ow. Wow, oh, that was... Okay, so that was terrible on my part. And it wasn't anything because... I'm not going to call game bullshit. I'm going to call... I'm going to call just poor decision making. I went in, three on one. 
didn't fire him right away. So they pow, pow, pow before I knew it. Is that half health? Alright. Let's try this again. She said, Psh. Truckers. So, okay, so there's the one thing that's like X percent chance to dismember. Drowners are coming out of there. Best blow it up. Like, Witch Slayer. Witchers, not quite the devil she thought. Aww. Somebody wrote a puff piece on us. Fire in the hole. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. There you go. 20 XP. Show me what you got. Brown dead. Ow. Ow. Okay. All right. You're. You're. Okay, all right. I just received 50 experience points for something. First one? No. Momenta, hybrids, insectoids, drowner, drowners, but there's no. Not an grid. Not a relics. Okay. So somehow I got. 50 experience points for killing a drowner drowned dead which must be some kind of special drowner I don't know I mean I'll take the free XP don't get me wrong but sometimes I uh you know want a little explanation for when I get for why I get XP Sometimes. Not all the time, but sometimes. Oh, I'm going to save that now, because... Now, I have, I have access to a boat. Which I guess doesn't really matter. Cause, well, it could take me here. Which it looks like I've kind of been there already. Alright, well, once again, we're gonna sit and chill. Oh, oh wait, nope, it's okay, it's morning. I'm like, oh, wait, no, it's dark! I can't heal! I can't heal, it's just rainy. So. Um. So anyway, before I got on that ridiculously long tangent about reaching out to the people, um, people I haven't talked to in a long time because they're former co-workers, or even just friends, like, there's... I have a couple like immediately pop in my head, like non coworker friends that I have not talked to in eight eons. 
that I really need to. So they're on the list too. So anyway, so not been busy at the first job. Hoping it'll pick up. In the same breath, though, it's kind of nice. <laughs> it's nice for once. It's nice for once not having to... Because for the longest time, I felt... Um, Um, so that's a decoction, but it's under the potions, not the decoctions. Is it because it doesn't require a specific, I don't know. Okay, so clears toxicity and cancels all active poison. Okay, well, let's craft. Okay, so I don't necessarily need to. Okay. So now I go here. Okay. Okay, so, oh, wow, we see, and this is probably something that was explained early on, but I did not pay attention. So is that one that, like, I use? Hmm, I don't know. That, that seems kind of a weird thing to want to use. But... Okay. 30, ooh. Okay. Um. Okay, so. Okay, we're going to replace... We're gonna replace cat. I kind of feel like cat is gonna be, or er, the white Rafford's decoction. And that's, I'm probably totally pronouncing that wrong. But that's gonna be more helpful than swallow? I have been playing this game wrong this whole time. Ay, ay, ay. All right. Here. So this is just me putzing around. All right. So now I can replace that. Take that out and replace you with the greater, which is 150 health. I 
have a lot of wraith mutagens. Feel like I should be able to use those for something. I can't. What do I get? What do I get out of it? Oh yeah, that's right. The uh, that's the you get a cune shield. Why can't I save my game right now? There we go. That's right. That pops the cune shield whenever some whenever one hit takes more than a third of my health. Oh, why don't I just... I'm doing this all wrong. Okay, yeah, I've... Oh my god, I've been playing... I... In all of the... It feels like months now. The months... Definitely weeks. Months, I've been playing this game. I've been... I just realized right now how wrong I've been playing. Jesus. So... Now I can use White Rat Bird's decoction, so that way in combat, boom, 35%. I can basically get 70% of my health back in two shots if I need to. Oh my god, I, what have I been... I, and then, like, I can truly, like, hardcore, not cheat, but whatever, by doing all that, getting my health back to full health, meditating, the alchemy resets all my charges on my potions. Oh my god, I've got to be, okay, so that's a game changer. I've got any time I see a potion, not a decoction, not an oil, a potion, I gotta buy it. Because it's like, shoot, that's like the reset charges thing. Alright, anyway. Alright, so Kune, um, inventory, potions, necrophage. Alright, I think I'm about as ready as I can possibly be without spending more time on it. So... Entrance. Entrance to what? Oh, wait, no, I was, that was right. Okay. For a sec. Do necrophage oil. Another one. How many more? Oh, it just says 20 charges. Okay, so once. Okay, so now once again with the oils. Do I run out of the oils? I'll have to keep an eye on that. Because if. Once again, if that's the case, that's another game changer, right? Just start making oils. Did that 
first one stop me that much? Or is this just... A glowing sword. Ooh, I forgot how ugly you are. Oh my god! Okay. Oh! Ow! Okay. Alright. Not great. Annoying that I had to like... I see you, buddy. I would have done better at that if I had done my white raffords instead of the swallow. Damn it. Because the swallow, every time you get hit, it pauses for two seconds. Alright, so. Same thing as before. Chill for a sec. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it. Ooh. Wow. Okay. I mean, so I don't know. How many people care about college basketball? I will fall on admit, outside of Wisconsin, I really don't care until tournament time, which I'm sure a lot of people are in that same boat. Outside of the one school they care about, they don't care about college basketball until uh, tournament. Get it? Ah, got... Alright, well, now I gotta kinda go. Skip it. Skip it. Yep. Ugly. Hey, not cool. So nice. Oh, wait. Inventory. Gotta reset my oils. I had him down to like. Problem is, I keep 
not paying attention to his health. I had him down to like quarter health. I am owning him. All right, so. Okay, we do that. All right. Nope, not doing that. That's what I wanted. Okay. I also feel like that. I have to pee. Okay, so I'm gonna go pee. BRB. Holy cow. Okay, all right. I was just about to talk about college basketball. Congratulations to Baylor uh, University of Baylor, Baylor University for their first men's national basketball championship. Good for them. I don't care. Bigger news. Illumination. The studio that brought uh, Sing. Probably a few other things, but Sing is the first one that I think of. 
Um, that movie's fun. Announced today, I because I I I saw it on the book face. I thought it was just one of those cute like, oh, wouldn't it be fun like fan made movie posters? No, Illumination is actually teaming up with Nintendo to make a Super Mario Brothers animated movie in 2022 for to release in 2022. Oh yes, sweet sweet redemption from that horrible, horrible live-action movie from the 90s. Pretty sure it's the 90s. Um, so awful. Just the worst. And it's like, the animation style is there. This could be a very easily made... They have everything in place for it. Wouldn't be that hard to make. And apparently now they're making it! Oh, that's so exciting! Cause I, cause I saw somebody post it, and I was like, "Oh, okay, that's funny, haha." Looks, that looks. Actually, I, at first I thought that looks really cool, and then I'm like, "Yeah, you know, it's Facebook, so probably fan made, haha." Then I saw somebody else post it, and I'm like, "Okay, same fan made things getting shared around. Fine, cool, whatever." Remember the hubbub about Nathan Fillion playing Nathan Drake for an Uncharted movie, and that basically fan made short basically his audition came out looked cool ended up not happening and then I saw third person sh share it and I'm like okay I gotta look into this now and then I actually googled it and it was actually released this is exciting there are because I tell you there are not a lot of good video game movies this one has the potential all right, let's go. All right, I'm so hyped. I'm ready to kill this. I'm ready to get to take out Swamp Thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Oh dear. Okay, all right, we good. Exactly, but that's the last. Um... Almost got you, homie. <laughs> oh, we're gonna get him. We're gonna get him. Okay, so what I think I need to preload to, because I noticed the, um, So we need to, ch all right, so we need to do a few things here. I'm like that, I was that close. All right, so get the necrophage oil on there. And I think what I need to do I'm 
everybody up on Kuhn. oil on got my thunderbolt ready got my white raffords decoction I'm probably saying that wrong which is making it sound really inappropriate but that's fine um, prepped I got one I got two um, charges of swallow Push comes to shove, I hit. Damn it. Okay. Let's try that again. Okay, I really think the oil is. Like it oil the oil's like the potions. And I just I keep it forever. Hey. Oh. There we go. I'm like, why is it not showing up there? Because I don't have my sword out. Alright. I've almost got you. I almost had you that last time. I, once again, I get This is not a great one. Alright, that's fine. Make it work. That's what we do. Ooh, that was close. I see the smoke moving around. Where are you? Oh, here. No. Okay, now. There we go. Alright, now we're in trouble. No, I did that. That was not uh, that sucked because I that was I was not off to a great start there because I I ended up having to use my white Rafford sooner than I wanted to. Because he got like three good hits on me before like I did any decent damage on him. Alright, All right, so inventory. Necrophage oil. I wish that 7% chance to stun would work. And, uh, was a, it was a higher percentage, but that's fine. We'll make, it, we'll make do, because that's what we do. We make do. I know I have it in me. Yeah, I know. All right. Nope. Ah. Come here. Damn it. 
Alright. Okay. Alright. Still okay. Ow! Oh, you son of a bitch. I got all right all right I think this is it like sorry I got quiet there for a second but I'm like Ugh! all right all right so now necrophage oil how's weapon health doing do I need to beef you up we're gonna beef you up anyway even though I don't probably need you all right oh dude you are so almost dead Oh no! you really really the hero and all that oh wait oh, oh. I need my I need my I need my Jesus saves guy where's my Jesus saves guy and all that was the potions which once again in retrospect makes me wonder if I had freaking used potions earlier knowing that I could just that they're not like one and done's that I can make them they have charges and then I reset the charges um Could I... Hell, could I have beaten the werewolf sooner? Maybe some of these fights that I'm like, run away from... Maybe I don't need to. Especially, man, that, uh, that white honey that just resets my toxicity. Sure, it cancels out all active statuses as a result of potions, but... Man, it cannot be it cannot be understated how handy that is especially when I started especially since that was the first time I ever got to like max toxicity and it's like oh shit my health's going down that be a problem All right. Hey. Don't mind me. Hey, Leslav. 
Monster's dead. Hogs dispersed. Ha! Village folk will be content. Give him cause to celebrate. Mm. Well, you've earned There's not much of a muscle there, I know. Well. I have what I call dad strength. We agreed. Master Witcher, that beast, it kept me from gathering peat. And I'd still my family to feed. But a few crowns left now, and I've yet to buy new tools. Show some mercy. I'll pay ye. I will pay ye twice the fee. But in a week's time, once I've made up some of my losses. No, agree. Yeah. Fine. So be it. But you remember that I'll remember. You won't get out of paying this. Thank you, Witcher. Thank you kindly, my lord. My little, I bless you. May ye be fruitful. Yeah, I've get to yeah, 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 yeah. You've only got a week. Okay, well now the question is, like, how long is a week? I, I mean, can I just sit there and, like, meditate it out for seven days? Oh, oh, oh my god, okay, yeah, so go here. Like this. Humana, humana, humana. Oh, okay. Now can I go back? Nope. That's really funny if I could just sit there and like reset. Like just keep going. Alright, well, that was that was incredibly satisfying. Guy, I better not come back and that guy be like dead because I'll be annoyed. No, I won't be because. Alright, here's the test about the oils, oils along with the potions. Hypothetically, if I create the. Enhanced hangman's venom. It should replace the hangman's because the hangman's venom isn't even on here. All right. There it is. Okay, so it's higher attack power and it's forty. Oh, okay. All right, dude. I've been playing this game. So wrong. Now that lets me make more than one. Oh, wait, no, there's. Okay, so now what does that do for my inventory? Oh my god, I've been playing this game all wrong. <laughs> I've been, I, all this time, I've been playing this game so wrong. I won't say that. I haven't been playing it wrong. I'm really not in the mood.
cute. Oh my god. So I could just basic, I, this whole time, instead of hanging on to all those, like, extra stuff, like, I could have just been making the potions and the decoctions. Like, this is a way better than, like, foods. I mean, you just gotta wait for the... You know. God, I'm so... I'm so annoyed with myself. I mean, I mean uh, above anything, I'm happy that I figured it out. But at the same time, like, I have been playing this game all wrong this whole time. Jeez Louise. Like, I should be using food. I should be using food, like, in between combat. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna try one of these bad boys out. Alright, so, I'm gonna try the one that... No, I'm gonna use the one that slows time down for everyone I kill. That's like, like a super buff, almost. That's crazy. Because it's like, okay, so I just, hypothetically, as long as this stays on, as long as I don't die or, what is it? As long as I don't die or, um, meditate. I can basically just keep... Oh, that's the Earth Elemental, right? Yep, that's the... Uh... Don't mind me. Just passing through. Man, there is so much depth to this game now that, like... I feel stupid for not recognizing it to, like, right now. Awkward! Alright, so now I'm wandering out here. This can't be good, but here we are. <laughs> Guarded treasure. Alright. We got. Come here. Ow! That's easy to do. Now the problem is... So I saved... 
when I, after I took the thing. Yep. So that makes me wonder if my poison goes away. Oh, good. I've been playing this game wrong this whole time. Now, the question is, does that toxicity eventually go down, or does it just stay up? I guess it would make sense that it... Sit here and eat. Nom 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 nom. I'm just like, I'm still just flabbergasted at myself. Alright, and water hags. Where are they? Spec no, they're not specters. Necrophages. Okay. Igneer Kuhn. Necrophage oil. Like really All right, come here. Give me that treasure. Give me that treasure. See? Now it's like. <coughs> now I. <laughs> okay, now I 
gotta avoid the fog light because I really alright so now where are my next two on the world map huh. I'll go to just I'll just go to down warden anyway something on the board hopefully I can get past the uh Foglet. Now this also just reinforces the fact that I'm gonna pick up all of this, all of the herbs I, plants I pass. Well, Roach is just somewhere eating in the field going... I don't know why I'm here. He just runs everywhere anyway, and then he ditches me in the middle of these fights, and then he just runs away, and then I'm just supposed to he just whistle, and I'm supposed to show up. Whatever. Get out of here. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, that's right. Okay, all right. Um, Algul is the... Ow! like so bad because it's like this one potion is so overpowered I don't want to say it's overpowered but like I just keep this house I just came out of right I just all I have to do is just keep killing people All I have to do is just keep killing people and I just keep gaining a higher max health. And it only resets when I meditate or I knocked unconscious. The problem is that this sucked at it. But I guess that's the trade off. It's like, okay, you can do this one thing to just keep climbing your health bar. You'll quite literally, though, not be able to use anything. No, and no other potions. So, good luck. There. I thought I cleared this out. Alright, well, I guess... I might have to clear it out again. And, let's swap out... Wait a
Hello. Get out of here with that garbage. I know there's another raid that went floating around. There you are. Come on. Man. Well, now what do I do? Um, all right, where am I? Right there. I suppose... Man, look at all those question marks. I'm actually kind of proud of myself for all these question marks I Oh, there's new there's new quests and stuff that popped up on in a few places. Hmm. Oh no, tonight is question mark. So let us continue with question mark. So let's pop over to Benek, I guess. No, no, I know what that is. Never mind. That is those wyverns. The wyverns that are trying to kill me. All right, but let's go. Alright, that's all right. Let's still go to Tadaros. Ah, uh, you know what? Yeah, let's let's do it. Let's go to Toderos so I can clear out those two. Then I can go up to Devil's Pit. Alright. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, because those are clearly still bright. Whatever reason I've not defeated him. All right, so, all right, so let's pop back over to Toderos. Pop over to Toderos. That is, those are new things. Kinda remind me of Drowners though. Oh my god! Oh! Oh! Oh, so they're kind of like... Rotters. Where when you kill them, they blow up. Alright, alright. 
What's with these little towns, like, getting wiped out? Oh, good, it popped me back here at least. Okay, well. Good to know about the devourers. Get away. Convenient. So now, okay, so, save, get a piece of bread, alright, and, oh, not what I wanted, okay, so now we're gonna go, we're gonna get that hidden treasure, clear out that bandit's camp, and I guess go all the way up to Devil's Pit? Yeah, we'll go up to the we'll go up to Devil's Pit and then we'll call it good. Alright. Definitely gotta stock up a door with spirit. Alright. that I can start formulating opinions on bad guys based on previous experience since I feel like I've battled a pretty wide range. I hate foglets. Forget those things. They are annoying. Oh, I don't know what you are, but you are going down, homie. Alright, so I'm gonna go out on a limb and assume that that is in, an insectoid. I'm like 
like a boss now. Once again. Alright. I thought I did this. So there's like a cave entrance or Come on now. Come on now as I say get out of here with that garbage. Alright, well that is it's down somewhere. You wanna try it? A little bit of me there we go. Come here. Alright, you wanna try it. Dude, this sucks for you. All right, let's go find some treasure. <laughs> let's go find some treasure. Go find some treasure. You get attacked by beasts. Screw you. I think you wish I had I wish I had that power. Treasure? Where are you hiding? Ah! That's sneaky. That was a sneaky place. Alright, well. Okay, next stop, Bandit Camp. <laughs> oh my god, Bandit Camp. Bandit Camp. Sounds pretty badass. Hmm. 
That looked like a, okay, hold on, hold up, hold up. That looked like a fancier crossbow. It is a fancier crossbow, I can't use it yet because it requires level 21. Damn it. Now it also requires level 21. Anything else? Once again, I take back everything I said whenever I was like, oh man, more dwarven spirits. I'll pick that up. Just kidding. I will always pick it up now. That looks like it should be a town. I don't think it is, but it looks like it should be. And now I can see how and why people would get lost in this game. I saw a post somewhere on Reddit that some guy put in like 150 hours into this game. Yeah, I can see that now. Oh, what a nice little town. Where is this? Oh, is this like the place I liberated? I feel like this is a place I liberated. Nope. I mean, it might be. So this is just a random town, but no fast travel, which I guess like Safe um, Which I guess like based on its location. I guess it doesn't really need to have a fast travel but All right, let's check out that little hut. Okay, so we're gonna check out that little hut go up to devil's pit And then call it They're okay, so there's a fast travel lurch. I just didn't So, uh, another when in doubt thing. Always go and check out a group of houses because it most likely is a town with a fast travel. Which all about, all about them fast travels. All right. So what do we got? What do we got? You a random house. Hello. I always like another thing that I admire about this game is like there doesn't need to be some interesting quirky side story or not every house is going to be teeming with people willing to share their food and whatnot. This is just a random house of some people living their best life that apparently got robbed. No, like, significance. There's no, like, big thing that needs to happen. It's just to show up. Let me check out this house. Oh, look. It looks like everybody's dead. No big clue as to why. It's the house of dead people. What are you going to do? What's up? What's up? How you doing? You're going to need that later. Trust me. Okay, I'm gonna do that. 
trust me, I'm helping you guys out. So it still pops me like all the way down there. That's interesting. Oh well. Alright. It's funny, like when I first started this game, I'm like, I'm gonna stick to the roads. No sense in wandering around. Especially since I have to do things like repair weapons and stuff like that not worth the time or effort and now that I'm like this far into the game and I realize all the extra stuff that happens I'm like nope I'm just gonna walk I'm gonna go as the crow flies pretty much wherever I go so that way I can gain XP I can now I now know I can I should collect herbs and plants gonna be something I check later. I'm totally, I feel like I'm totally, I should totally Google, like, Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. Uh... Oh no, okay, I see, so it's got a timer. So this is as good a place to stop as any. So thanks for everyone that hung out. Appreciate it. Anyone checking out the VODs later? Hope you enjoy them. Otherwise, I'll catch you on the...